Oh my god, perfetta! Bravo, bravo! Yes, Francesco! Hi there, Chris! Hi, so you very welcome to Wales. Pleasure. I mean, I'm a big fan of Wales, as you know. Big fan of the Welsh lamb. I'm the biggest Italian fan of Welsh lamb ever. Yes, wow. we've got a beautiful bone shoulder here. What are you cooking today? But I'm going to do a very, very simple recipe. It's called piadina. It's come from Emilia Romagna. It's basically a snack, a street food. We usually don't do piadina with cooked meat, but when you got Welsh lamb, you have to come up with something. So it's the perfect dish to do it low and slow. Yeah, with exactly. a shoulder, it's a bit of a tough cut, but yeah, give but... it some uh, Francesco Italian love. <laughs> yeah, baby. So the shoulder's getting a bit of colour in the pan with the garlics. Yeah. In goes the white wine, with the rosemary, paprika, peppers, chili, peeled tomatoes, veg stock, salt to finish. So crisp. Now it's going to go in the oven for a couple of hours. Love it. What we want is a bit of burn things on top. 165. And let's say we'll check every hour, but two and a half hours, three hours for the perfect. Boom. Thank you. Yes. Great. So, cucumber now. Just a gentle cold pickling. Very, very simple. Nice. Straightforward. Salt, sugar, dill, with the ginger, quite rustic. And what we do, just like that. Beautiful chef. Simple stuff is the best. This is stuff I will cook at home every day, right? But I'm never home, that's the problem. <laughs> a bit of vinegar, one hour, ready to go. Beautiful. Yeah. So this has been cooking three and a half hours. Three and a half hours. You've let it rest. Let it rest. Chef. Look at that. Oh. Moist, beautiful. And I love the depth of color through not putting the lid on, no. getting that exactly. caramelization. That's it. That's what you want Chef. because that will give the flavor. Look at that. Wow. Oh, look, 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 look. Oh my god, perfetta, perfetta. Wow, so good. You know what? That's good. But do you mind to start to pull or flaky for me a bit? Because you're the master of this. I'm yeah, just, I, mean, I got inspired when I see you. It's like pizza, Jeff. Fantastico. Look, I'm going to pass this through the moulin now. And we're going to make a sauce out of this, really. Okay, we got the pepper, two colors, roast garlic, chili, paprika. Well, very garlicky. Now, the piadina, the piadina, we're gonna make piadina. Mm. So this is quite quick flatbread recipe. Yes. So double zero flour, water, and give a bit of lard. Okay. Now I'm gonna use one of these pots here. Piadina. Whoa. Woo! Well, first of all, a bit of sauce, yeah. Mozzarella. It's like that. Oh, wow, 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 wow. This is the piadina in the oven. Pack. Wow. Three minutes I'm ready. It's gonna be good. <laughs> Three minutes. Let's yeah, come on. <laughs> oh. This is the reveal, Francesco. Oh, oh, we are on a. Okay, so that's piadina with Welsh lamb shoulder, mozzarella, pickled cucumber, and his own salsa. How cool is that? Very cool. Very, Mamma very. Mamma mia, che bello. Wow. I think we should try that now, right? It's messy eating. Chris. The ox chef. That's yours. That's mine. I'm gonna do it like this. Mm. Bravo, bravo. It's messy, but it's good. And you know, it's like a roller coaster of flavors and textures. You've got the crunchy flatbread, but soft and fluffy. Then the lamb melts in the mouth. The lamb's beautiful. The sauce, it's just a turbocharged sauce. And that pickle, that cucumber pickle, it's just perfect, man. <laughs> bueno. 